Hi, it's Angie with News OK. And Becky. And Becky is our recipe for health food columnist for the Oklahoma, and she's also a registered dietitian. Now, it is the new year we're so excited about starting 2012 fresh and new, and we want to start it healthy. So she has a great theme for this year. Tell us about that. Well, Angie, our theme is from your table to your good health. And we want to really emphasize that the purpose of food is to be enjoyed, of course, but the real purpose of food is for good nutrition. It's to nourish our bodies. And so we want that to always be our focus. And yes, we can make it wonderful and delicious too, and we do do that. Exactly, and today's From Your Table to Your Health recipe is stuffed peppers. Yes, and one of the reasons that I wanted to do stuffed peppers is we always want to keep the idea of color in mind. And look at the gorgeous colors of these peppers. Beautiful. They're just beautiful. beautiful. And we're using all very healthy, nutritious ingredients. Yes. And so for what we're going to start with with our peppers, um, this recipe will make six medium okay. or four large peppers. Okay. And I've already cut the top ah. off of this one and taken the insides out. Um, and you can just use a spoon to okay. do that. It's very simple to do. I've cooked whole grain rice. Which this is the rice right here. Absolutely. We've. Um, and the whole grain rice, the thing that we want to focus on is that at least half of the grains need to be whole grain. Onions, and these are very finely chopped. You can see they're yeah. little bitty pieces. You can do this in a food processor or by hand. Okay. And then I'm going to put like a little Worcestershire sauce, very small amount of uh, uh, salt and pepper. Mm -hmm. And then I have cooked my lean, very lean ground beef. And a quick stir, very okay. simple to make this just in here like so. That is so nice and easy. Yeah. We're getting a vegetable, yep. we're getting very lean um, protein actually, and then our whole grain yes. rice. Yes. It's important that the peppers have a nice flat bottom uh -huh. to them. If they don't, like this one, you can just take a knife and oh, there you go. cut a little bit so off to stand. flatten it so they'll stand. That's yes. great. And uh, then this is um, just plain tomato sauce. Sure. We've added a little bit of that fat-free broth and then bake these. Mm -hmm. They bake at 400 degrees. Okay. And uh, we've got some right here that we have already baked. Oh, they are beautiful too and like you said, so colorful. Yes. This is a great idea. Obviously, if you are uh, wanting something healthy and from your table uh, to your health, I mean, for good health, this is wonderful. Okay, yes, but you have another idea for us as well. We do. Okay. All right, we are staying with the theme of peppers and instead of stuffed peppers, we're doing roasted peppers? Yes. This can be served as a side dish, very, very simple. We're starting with a couple of tablespoons of olive oil. Okay. Just pour that in my bowl. I've got some seasonings here, some basil and nice. garlic, and uh, we're going to stir this up. And then uh, what I've done with my peppers, Angie, I'm using all different colors I of love peppers it. with this. I know. It's so They're bright and just pretty. Beautiful. Uh, so we have the red, green, yellow, and orange, but people could use all one color or any combination sure, that they would the want. That's, That's exactly true. right. And we're gonna just stir this. And all we're gonna do is put this in a baking dish, yeah. bake it at 400 degrees Great. Uh, for about 30 minutes. That's all there is to it. Oh, that is so nice and yes. simple. I love it. I love it. Okay, well, so now with a, you know, obviously camera TV magic, we've got the final product right here. This is the final dish. It's beautiful, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And we've just put a little bit of balsamic vinegar on it, just sprinkled that on just before nice. we serve it. Peppers are a great source of vitamin C. Really? as well as multiple phytonutrients. These are great ideas if you are interested in, you know, getting healthy for the new year from, you know, your table to your good health. These are great ideas. Becky Barner has them in her food column. Just check out the Oklahoman in the life section for Becky Barner's recipe for health food column and obviously on newsok.com as well. Thank you so much. Thank you, Angie.